What's going on, guys? Watch me here. Just want to talk about Puerto Rico and man, <clears throat> what they've been going through. This is the USGS, and um, this is Puerto Rico zoomed in. Um, I can zoom out as you can see the island right there. Seems like all the quakes were on the west side of the island in this region. So the latest one, they had a couple today, actually. <clears throat> they had a 3.7 today. They had a 3.3 uh, so they're still having quakes there, man. There was a bigger one. There was like a five or a four point. Um, I'm not trying to find that one. Uh, There's a four point two. That was yesterday. Three point three. Okay, let's see. Puerto Rico. Four. Maybe it was a four point two then. Yeah. No, the four point five. Four point five. Hella shallow. Only nine kilometers deep. Shallow as hell. I don't hear anything. 50 and lower is shallow. You get in the single digits, that's super. So the shallower the quake, the more damage, the, the more powerful and, and whatnot. So they've had quite a few quakes since today. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. <clears throat> twelve quakes, okay? Aftershocks, whatever you want to call them. Still quakes um what is going on all of a sudden what the hell what kind of movement it must have been a lot of pressure built up there that's just breaking down i don't even know so let's see this clip was published today by uh, routers.com it's a photo there of uh you know homeless houses have been destroyed waiting to be rebuilt nearly five thousand people left without um, homeless by a series of quake taking refuge in government shelters officials said on Monday in addition hundreds of if not thousands more who are sleeping outside their homes because they're scared to go back in their homes uh, the public power utility PREPA also known its Spanish acronym announced power was restored to 99% of homes and businesses while also urging people to conserve energy because the largest generating plant on the Caribbean Island remains offline. <clears throat> Prep has shut down the power grid as a safety precaution amid a series of earthquakes, including one of a 6.4 Mag 2 last Tuesday that damaged nearly 600 buildings and killed at least, sorry to say, one person. Sorry about that. Heart goes out to the family of the person. So these guys are like, you know what I mean? dealing with power issues on top of the quakes and their houses are messed up. And it's like, it sucks. I've been there. I've been there. We got evacuated and, and, um, but we had more resources and stuff like that on the, uh, Orville dam, uh, emergency evacuation. These guys, I can't even imagine. I mean, it's sad. I'm sorry. My heart goes out to you guys. That being said, thank I'll keep an eye on Puerto Rico. It's crazy on how many quakes have been going on. It's just, it's it's insane to me that it's like a higher dose of Yellowstone. Because Yellowstone has thousands, if not hundreds, of quakes. And then the summertime is like their most, you know, activity time. But these guys, it's like they've been quiet. They got some of the beautiful beaches in the world. And, and they're just getting hit and hard all of a sudden, just back to back quakes like it's Frisco, but tw 100 times more. Like, <clears throat> you just can't have quakes like that. Something's going on down there. Who knows? What's your thoughts? God bless. And when I tell you to look right, look left.